<laughs> Your appreciation has been most intelligent. Which persuades me that you think almost as highly of the play as I do myself. What is the name of this friend of yours? Oscar. <laughs> Oscar Wilde. Oh, Jesus Christ. I hear you're writing a new play. Superb. Avotos. Constance, my dear, beautiful wife. You and my sons are the things that tie me to life. Oscar, let's run away. Someone no one could find us. You don't know what you're saying. Not wearing your silk stockings today, Oscar. You go too far, sir. No, you go too far, madam. I am a ruined man. Oscar Wilde, the crime of which you have been convicted is so bad, you must be dead to all sense of shame. Oscar bleeding wild! I shall, under such circumstances, pass the severest sentence that the law allows. The sentence of the court is that you be imprisoned and kept to hard labor for two years. For two years, I have lain on hard woods, knelt on cold stone, dined on shame. I'm ready to return to life. I feel sure that if I was to see him once, I would forgive him everything. I can make you happy. Yes, you can. I dare say what I have done is fatal. Be careful, Roscoe. I love him as I always did, with a sense of tragedy and ruin. There's no mystery so great as suffering. But suffering is nothing when there is love. Love is everything. I'm in mortal combat with this wallpaper, Robbie. One of us has to go.